Hello families, let's talk about advisory day. And this is something that you may have heard about if your child has been at Lakeland for some time. It's a recurring event. We had a little bit of disruption due to the pandemic, but we're bringing it back in person. We did have to go virtual with it last year. But for those who may have participated in it differently, this is a new opportunity to get, to get a different experience. Or even if they just wanna have a different kind of mentor to talk to, the, we're going to talk about what this is, when it is, and what you need to do if you're interested in having your child or student participate. So these are the flyers that went out for the first quarter. Now we're in the second quarter. It's actually three different meetings that happen. And what it is is that basically we have three organizations that are volunteering a bunch of mentors, working adult working professional mentors. They're going to come to have one-on-one -on -one discussions with students about what their career, career interests are. And that's a really amazing thing considering that we have people from finance, real estate, business development. Uh, we have all different types of people from technical and creative fields coming to talk to students and offer a different perspective. And it's not just focused on the academics. Yes, they have the ability to look at the students' report cards and talk a little bit about it, but that's not the main focus. It's really to just think about what are you really passionate about? What are you interested in? And for those of children that have already thought about this, this may give them a new perspective because they're also sharing relatable experience about, you know, some of these mentors are in the same exact, we're in the same exact shoes of the students. Maybe they didn't like their classes. Maybe they didn't like doing what they had to do. Maybe they just didn't think there was something out for them and then they eventually found it. And then they, they can share what they did and how that happened. This is a really interesting time to get that information and, and they can really put that to use. So students really enjoyed their conversations. I talked to a lot of them after on their way out and some of them didn't even want to go back to class. I'm going to be, that's completely true. So they seem to have a really good bond and we're going to keep the students with the same mentors as best as we can, but we're getting fresh new mentors. These organizations are volunteering new mentors. So we want to get new students to join them so we can get everyone paired up and take advantage of this opportunity. So it's going to happen on Friday, February 3rd during school hours. You don't, there's no cost involved. You don't need to dress up or anything. They just come to school like normal and they're going to get a pass that morning that tells them their scheduled time. It's a 20 minute discussion. And all they do is show up at that time to the location. We're going to define where that is. And then they uh, go back to class. That's really it. There's nothing to it. And they're going to have a little bit of follow up from their last one. And if this is their first one, it's OK. They'll have that discussion for the first time. And then they're going to see them again for the third quarter. And so there's a little bit of follow through just to see how things have changed. And it gives them a chance to think of new different conversation pieces and questions. And it's a really good opportunity for them, again, even if they've done it. So these are the permission slips that we ask people to sign. Um, if you've already signed it, that's fine. You don't need to do it again. But if you haven't participated at all, you're the ones that are going to need to sign this. And if you didn't get one before and your child participated or whatever, we're, I'm, I'm going to need to get one to you. So we're going to get one to you, even for some of you that maybe I got a verbal confirmation or we talked about it. Um, so just you don't have to do anything right now other than just talk to me and let me know that you're interested in signing up your child or children. If you have multiple children through sixth through eighth grade, it's only for sixth, seventh and eighth graders. So if you have multiple children in middle school and you want only like some or all of them to do it, let me know which ones. 410-929-3590 is my number. I am Mr. Castro, the community school coordinator, and you can reach out to me. Miss Savage is our school counselor, and she deals a lot with per career and professional and personal development, but I'm the one who can really help you with coordinating this event. Um, I'm running a lot of the logistics, so just reach out to me, and I will be happy to get a permission slip your way and work with you if you have any other questions as well. Thank you very much, and we hope to see the kids there on February 3rd.